everybody welcome i've got a friend mail package today to show you so i want to thank very much nat from uh, or natalie from uh, nat's nifty 50 nails so i'll put it up on the screen somewhere um and she's on youtube and she does some videos so she said to me i've got some acrylic i've not been using do you want me to send it yet so i said yeah well that lovely of you oh she sent me a card what's this um, I'm an avid recycler, hence the box. Yes, I did. I did recognise it as a bar nail box. I know you're a new, a new advocate. Uh, you love your bar nails, so I knew it was one of their boxes. Um, but I was expecting the powder. I didn't expect this much, though, to be honest. Enjoy the little box of goodies. Thank you for supporting my channel. I know as you can comment. Well, of course they can comment because she does some lovely nails and some lovely. Well, she does holes and all sorts. So. Thank you, Natalie. Pop over and have a look. At the time of me filming this, I had a look and she was on 99 subscribers. Come on, surely we can get her over 100. Let's uh, show some love to each other. That's pretty. Oh, I've got uh, glitter bells. Born pretty. I'm going to swatch them. Um, pink, white... Jelly pink. Oh, it's Savilland. Savilland. That's all she said she'd go. Some Savilland ones. So thank you ever so much for sending me all these extras as well. Oh. And I just caught the um, postman. I've been out and I just come back and he was there. So I think they tried to deliver it yesterday. So I got it today. I've even got a little Varnell bubble wrap. <laughs> Oh, what's this? You're naughty. Ooh. Let's have a look. They're nice. I like those. Thank you. Oh, I've got some little bows and teddies. <laughs> oh, I like that. That's pretty. Ooh, dropping them all. That's a nice foil, pink and gold. Thank you, love. What have I dropped? Uh, na 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 na. <laughs> Yo, hearts. <laughs> What's this one? Little handbags. And more stickers. Love. Roses. Believe in your dreams. Yes. Believe in your dreams. Well, not if the nightmares. Uh, silver foil. Thank you. Oh, that's a pretty glitter. That's nice. It's got all colours in that silver back. There's a right load in there. Wow. And some more little tinies. What are these? Oh, I like that. And little four-pointed stars. Oh, butterfly wings. Oh, they're pretty. Oh, thanks ever so much, Nat. You're a little love. So I'll just get a, a mat out and some little swatch sticks and we'll swatch these colours. So do these Savilland ones, that one's transparent, so that's great. I'll not bother swatching that one, but I'll do these pinks. That's pretty, isn't it? It's the palest pink, that. That is lovely. Oh, 
That would be nice for a baby boomer. I've got a bone pretty, oh, plain white. And let's swatch this pink. This is uh, just called pink. These are big pots. Oh my word, you haven't used any of this. Goodness me, love. Oh, I like that. That's like, um, it's got a jelly look to it. That's pretty. Oh, that's really pretty. Look at these, aren't they pretty? Three different solid pinks and two jellies. They're beautiful. Thanks so much, Nat. That's really thoughtful of you. Don't forget, everybody, please pop over and support her. When you're watching all these uh, videos, it's lovely to support each other. So it's Nat's Nifty 50 Nails. It's up here somewhere. So I've decided just to do this little set. And I have stuck um, the nail beds in. Put these little tips on. I've squashed them a bit because they had a C curve and I've made them a bit flatter. And then I've buffed over and got it ready for application. So I would go in and put a primer on and then we'll start with some acrylic application. I've got this glitter that Nat sent me, which I want to use because it's got all different colours in. And then with that, I'm going to put these um and i've no idea where yet i've got mimosa and sex on the beach and pink flamingo which are all from the cocktail range of sparkle supplies absolutely love these uh and then also this one which is called bewitched so we've got all these colors so i'm just freestyling and winging it because i don't know what i'm going to do on each one and i'm going to use the Savilland clear uh, the Jelly Pink, which is that one. Uh, don't know if I need any other. Yeah, let's get cracking. We'll see. Uh, I am going to wire the voiceover or put some music on here because it's just easier for editing. So, see you in a bit. I'm just starting with this middle name, nail because this is going to need filing into before I put the second colour on. So what I've decided to do is put a little coat of clear on first. So that uh, strengthens that join where I've stuck the tip on and then it gives you something to file down to. So feel free to put a coat of clear on your nail bed and down onto your tip if you're worried about putting glitter on and filing down the glitter because it can be a bit more difficult if you're not used to it. So yeah. By all means, very, very thin coat uh, and you're not going to be near your nail bed when you've got all the glitter off. So what I'm going to do is sprinkle a little bit of this silver glitter from uh, Nat onto a tray, which I subsequently knock over at some point. So watch out for that. Um, and I'm just opening up all these glitters and I'm going to put a little stripe of these glitters with the clear acrylic. 
So I'll pop you a bit of relaxing music on while I just do that. I'm just doing this bit here so I've gone from silver to purple to pink and now I'm doing the orange and then in putting it in I decided that there was no not enough of a difference um, from the pink to the orange because of it being a narrow stripe so what I do is before it's set I go no moving <laughs> so I'm moving it down so I've just got enough time to get it moved and then I'm going to come in with the yellow in between it I'm going to file the sides of this, but I'm trying to keep it as straight as I can. So I'm just going to pick up some yellow, stick that in there. And then I will go over the top of this and encapsulate it with clear. Um, and I don't mind how high it is, so long as I've got a, a nice uh, thickness to put my straight e-file against it and make a straight line. And then we'll let that set and move on to the next nails. So I'll finish with that one. This one is going to be the index finger and the ring finger are going to be almost the same. 
except um well i'm doing silver at the bottom of both and then on this one uh, i've got one of the cocktails i can't remember if it was pink or orange now um pink i think and then on the ring finger i'm doing the silver but with purple so because they're both the same i'll just show you this one uh, and then on the ring finger i'm going to do graduated colours like I have on the middle finger but all the way across the nail so again you've seen that so I'll just leave you watching this and I'll be back in a bit So I'm just finishing off with this core powder pink just for the uh, nail bed on this one and then I'll do the same on the index finger and I'm just feathering it down a little bit over the glitter. So once I've built a little bit of height to that apex you'll see that the bottom looks thinner so I'm going to encapsulate that with some clear then. Just to make sure I'm holding all that glitter in and I'm getting that shape back that I want. And again, same on the index finger. So I'm doing all this encapsulation before I do the middle finger because that needs the filing doing down either side of the stripe uh, and then it needs the pink to go on. So if I do all this first I'm not going to get any filing dust stuck on all that glitter. It'll just wipe straight off the top of this. So I'm tapping it. If it's a high pitched little knock rather than a dull knock, then you know it's dried enough. Oh, I'm just showing you there that I'm using my uh, file with the curved part towards the nail rather than up so that it's going above the cuticle and not cutting into it. I think I'll show you from side at some point. Or maybe not. <laughs> I forget which bits I've left in and which bits I've cut out. So that's it. Just making sure it's nice and straight. Oh, I'm showing you there, look. So it's not going up a finger. And then I'm going to fill either side of that with um, some pink. So I've dusted it off and then I've just wet that side down a little bit with monomer and then gone in. I've got my beads a bit runny. I've not got used to it yet. But it's doing the job. I 
You want to try to not have your beads too runny because you've got more strength then. But don't forget, we've got the clear under all this anyway, so that's adding to it. So just to that side, build that apex a little bit and then do the other side. back and chat with you seeing as we're on the final bit I um, I've done all the filing so I've gone over it with the two, uh, 120 buffer and then uh, what I've decided to do is I'm going to put a bit of white on it don't know why I just think it needs it <laughs> even though it's got all this bling so I'll just clean up a load of this dust There we go. And they spilled the glitter. And I'll just paint some four pointed stars. So I've got my Madame Blam gel paint. And some tiny little dots, I think. So while that's in the lamp, what I just want to say is thank you very much for watching, everybody. Thanks especially to Nat for sending me this through. So I'll put the uh, link to her channel in the description box. If you have enjoyed it, if you've got anything from it at all, even if it's five minutes entertainment, please click the like button because that helps me enormously. I've got loads and loads of links for different products in the description box below. So do yourself a favour because if you're anything like me, you forget who you've seen dis discount codes with and what for. So just save one of the videos into one of your favourite playlists on YouTube and you can go back to it and find them all. So, uh, yeah, if you've not considered subscribing, if you don't mind doing that, and I will just leave you with uh, doing some top coat.
Thank you, everybody. Love you loud. Take care. We'll catch each other.